You're watching Adorama TV. Hi everybody, welcome to this week's episode of Adorama TV iPad App Reviews. I'm Mark Wallace. Well this week we're going to take a look at Pocket Booth HD and it is for taking awesome photos in a photo strip kind of view. The kind of things that you might have done uh, when you went to the fair or something in your past and it was just sort of fun. You sat in this little booth and you take pictures and out comes a strip of four. Well that's exactly what this guy does. So let's take a closer look at this awesome app. Let's take a closer look at Pocket Booth HD. Now this guy opens right up, you see the little photo booth. And what I've done is I've put uh, Stunt Pig behind here so he can be posing for us. Now the nice thing is with Pocket Booth HD, you can use either the rear, rear camera or you can use the front camera. And if I flip this around, you'll see that here we are, there's my hand and I'll flip this back around so we're using the rear cam camera. And it's very, very easy to take pictures. Now this is gonna take uh, four photos when I hit start and so, it has a red light telling us, hey, we're going to take pictures and I'll have Stunt Pig move here. I'll have him look funny. There he is. And then maybe like that. There it goes. Okay, now we have our photo booth. And this is a black and white image of Mr. Stunt Pig. So here it is. There it is. Four images. Now we can change uh, all kinds of things here. And so all I have to do is I can pinch this in so it zips back down. And you can see that we've done a few different photo booths here. And uh, we've changed these settings. And so to do that, all I have to do is go to this little gear and then you can change the strip size from four poses to three. So I'll say three poses here and then I'll go back and I can change the photo effect. So I have it on black and white. I really like the black and white look, but let's say let's have it to 1975, which is sort of an old cross color processing type of uh, look here. We can change the paper stock from glossy to matte. Matte's going to give it some texture. It'll look really sort of cool. You can change the border color from black to white. And then we can change the time between shots from two seconds to three or four or five seconds or even down to one second. I'll leave it at two seconds because I sort of like that. And then you can also have it auto save just to the app or to the app and your phone or your iPad. And the other thing is you can uh, set the default either the rear or front camera. And then there's some information about Pocket Booth. And then there's this other really cool thing here called Export Strips. And so I could just click that and it'll take all of my uh, photo strips that I've created and save that to the camera roll. So instead of having to save them one by one, you can do them all at once. So let me take another uh, shot here of Stunt Pig. This time using the new uh, processing that we've set up, which is color and the different uh, background papers. So I'll hit start. It's going to give me the countdown. And there it goes. So here's Stunt Pig moving again. Here he is, there. and we only did three shots this time instead of four, and so our photo roll is a little bit smaller, and we can take a look there, and you can scroll around. Now, let's say we have this, and again, this is that 1975 effects look, and I want to share that with friends. I can click on this. I can email this photo strip. I can publish it on Facebook or to Twitter. I can save it to my camera roll, or I can go ahead and print if you have a printer that enables you to do wireless printing from your iPad. So all kinds of different ways that you can share this. And that's all there is to it. It's an awesome app. You can send out these photos to just about anywhere, email and Facebook and Twitter, etc. So download it today. Now remember, if you have an iPad app that you uh, have looked at or maybe you have questions about, please send your suggestion for the next iPad app review to Ask More Mark at Adorama.com. Well, thanks again for joining me this week, and I'll see you again next time. This episode is brought to you by Adorama TV. Visit the Adorama Learning Center where you'll find photography tips and techniques, links to the gear used in this episode, and related videos. For all the latest photography, video, and computer gear, visit Adorama.com. And the next time you're in New York City, visit our store located on 18th Street between 5th and 6th Avenue.